Hello guys, as you can see I'm now creating another video and that is not infamous too because I made a promise I would not resume that until two weeks have passed so I'm not breaking that promise. This is another game of mine, it's called Gran Turismo 5. Well it's actually pretty well known, it's uh, Sony's best sold game, the best uh, PlayStation exclusive game so you should know it I, I guess. I'm here driving with the fastest car of the game, which is not really fair compared to the other cars I have to drive against, but it's fun though, actually just driving. What I, uh, what, this is a 24 hour race and it may seem a lot, and it is, but uh, how do I do that? How do I, well, as you may have noticed, right here you can see that I'm resuming at 4 hours. I can stop whenever I want and resume whenever I want, so that's a good thing. It didn't used to be. So, well, now it is. So I can resume whenever I want. And I'm resuming right now. And it takes a little long to refuel. But that doesn't matter because the speed totally makes up for that. 19 laps, I'm still ahead of them from 19 laps. Okay, now let's see if the delay is a little worse. No, it's actually pretty fun. Hey, why is it not? Oh, wait. Oh, shit. I take it back. The delay is gigantic. <laughs> okay. I try to drive. This is going insanely fast. I'm not used to it, even though I've been doing this for four hours. Okay, now compare this speed to the other racing cars right here. He's going 200 and, well, let's say 200 and I'm going to drive next to him. Yeah, say 300 and now here I go with 370, 80, 90, 400, 410, 400. Whoa, you're... Oh, it also breaks very good. Well, let's see how fast this thing can go. I believe it was 460, and the acceleration is very fast, as you realize. But wait till you see that happen. This thing takes corners like no other. It's just a little hard to see where I've got the brakes since. Ah, we're fine. Okay. So, uh, so far. Do 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 do. I, I used to play in 3D on my uh, TV, so I just go like this in 3D and HD is awesome. Doing that for, for 24 hours doesn't mind me at all as long as I don't have to do it at once. Just one hour or half an hour a week, no, not a week, maybe one hour each two days. Because next two weeks I'll be busy working, so I don't, so I don't have much time. Anyways. Um, this track actually really exists, and that's that's the fun thing about this game. The most most of the tracks really exist, so um, that that is really it's really fun to to to, to know that you're driving on a real track with a game which specializes itself being a simulator. So it, although this may not seem very simulating, since this is just insanely fast, and oh, there's also no damage in the game, which I Okay, you know it's it's a racing simulator, not a crashing simulator. But it a little damage couldn't hurt, right? I crashed with this over a thousand times, and it just still looks like new. Watch this, nothing at all. See if there is something happened to his back. I guess not. Now a close sleep. This is not HD, so I shall uh, go very close to him. Or perhaps hit him again. See, nothing happened to it. Nothing happened. Okay, maybe this. No, nothing happened. Let's keep it on that. And um, I'm doing two laps. This is my second one. Whoa. I like this because. Um. Yeah, why do I like it? I just like it. I don't know why. It's just fun to do. Driving really insanely fast and then taking corners like. Whoa. I'm 19 laps ahead of them when I've driven 90 laps. See? And 
to be honest, the difference between the second car and the last one is really, really big. So, uh, I overtook the last one over, if I have to guess, over maybe 30 times by now. It's, it's just really, really slow. Um, I'm, I'm doing this using a controller and it sometimes it's a bit... This car is so insanely wild that you sometimes really need a steering wheel and need to feel the force that it's giving you in order to really, well, be in that car. This is a little hard to to do with the controller, but it, you get used to it. Well, I now notice, it's a little late that I noticed it, but I now notice that not my full screen is used uh, as it did in infamous hmm well that doesn't really matter I'm looking in the middle of the screen well, I should look at the middle of the screen so I should not have noticed but I did Oop. Ah, no, no, no. Uh, th this car is uh, the answer to the question of uh, Sony got in a uh, question what would the fastest car be like if it had not to uh, if there were no rules and this is the answer. So they, they went back to a band prototype of the Chaparral 2G, which was in the, in the 70s. And, um, well, that was a really successful thing. The only thing was when it goes onto the grass, or well, as I shall demonstrate right now, it can't do anything anymore because it uses all the air pressure of the spoiler stuff and things. This thing is one big spoiler and it uses that to suck itself to the ground, to the asphalt. And then it's got a man's grip, so that's what um, makes it turn so fast. But once you're on the grass, that doesn't work anymore. So that is what a chaparral was banned because, well, that's not good needs to be safe a bit and um, I'm wasting time right now I, re I really don't care since I'm 19 lap ahead, laps ahead so uh, well, if I turn the traction into it, turn it off now I got Let's see if this improves acceleration well it does doing one more lap then Form how long have I been recording? One more lap without traction control this time. Holy, that's different. Okay. Anyway, uh, this was the answer to that question, and combined with the technology of today, they could amplify the power of what they did 70 years ago and create this humongous monster out of it. It is not built in real life yet, I think, or. Well, if everyone, if the F, if this uh, replaces the Formula One car, it would be very cool. But don't you think this is a bit too fast for reality? I mean, look at it. There's no damage in this game. But if there was, I, well, I, I, I guess at least 60% of these cars, which will then be built, will be destroyed in the first race or first lap of a race. Because this thing is almost not be able to handle. Okay, well, that's proven. Um, why am I doing three laps again? Oh yeah, I wasn't finished my explanation yet. Anyway, I'll stop here talking, finishing this.
Okay, you would be really, really dead now if you weren't playing the game. Holy fuck, I forgot I turned the APM up. What was... Oh, he's gonna pay for that if I'm be able to start slowly. Okay. See if I can still catch on with that guy. Nah. Um, stopping right here. And we click suspend. Yes. And now I save again, so now I can resume. I can turn off my PS3 and resume any time I want. So that's a good thing. The only thing I don't like about this is that you can. Uh, when you boot you can choose to resume or to cancel and not do something else and resume another time so um, uh, well for example uh, I'm playing this race and uh, a friend is coming over he wants to play a uh, race split screen and then I have to either say no or cancel out my 24 hour race which is not something I need to do that fast so uh, they could work on that Anyways, that's Gran Turismo. Bye.